A troubling event has been happening in a faraway place called Xinjiang, a large part of China. This story is about the difficulties and suffering that many people there have been facing, and it's known as the Uyghur Genocide. In Xinjiang, a land with ancient traditions and diverse cultures, a group called the Uyghur Muslims, along with other minority communities, have experienced a harsh crackdown by the Chinese government. Some people say that the Chinese government is forcing Uyghur Muslims to change their beliefs. But, the Chinese government vehemently denies these claims, saying they are invalid. The stories from Xinjiang are alarming. They show that Muslim Uyghurs are being held in special camps. The Chinese government says these camps are for job training and to prevent extremism, but there are reports suggesting something different. Inside these camps, Muslim Uyghurs were made to stop being Muslims and practice other religions, and if they refused, they were punished, sometimes along with their families. For two, three months, I cannot reach anyone. And I heard that the crackdown is happening. People are disappearing. I didn't know how to, how to react. It was just so painful and so the worry that when you cannot reach, when you cannot find the news. And then finally in January 2017, after repeatedly called my, my eldest brother, who's like my father to, to me, and he answered the call. And then I said, why no one is answering my phone call? He said they did the right thing. And quietly, and that it was really shaky voice, said, leave us in God's hands. He put the phone down. And that is the last time I spoke to, you know, anyone from my family. And I was completely cut off. Some people say that Uyghurs and other minorities are being made to work in factories against their will in these camps. They're also losing their cultural heritage, with reports saying that the Chinese government is trying to suppress Uyghur culture, Islam, and language. Religious places were destroyed, and spiritual practices were stopped. Recent reports suggest that the Chinese government wants to make Uyghur Muslims become more like the Ha Chinese majority. They encourage marriages between Uyghurs and her Chinese, which goes against Uyghur culture. Children are said to be separated from their parents and families, which is against Muslim tradition. There's a lot of surveillance with cameras and technology watching Uyghur Muslims all the time, making them afraid and limiting their freedom of speech. But why is all of this happening? We need to have all the answers. The Chinese government says these actions are necessary for their security. They worry about extremism, terrorism, and separatism in Xinjiang and believe these actions will keep the region stable. However, some experts think the government wants to make all Uyghurs the same, erasing their cultural and religious differences from the Ha Chinese majority. Political control also plays a role. The Chinese Communist Party might be doing these things to show they have power over every part of the country. No matter the reasons, it's a shocking situation that the world is watching closely. Stay tuned for more updates from The Politician.